Hey guys, it's Tiffany. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a brand new toy featuring LeBron James. It's this new Space Jam, a new legacy movie figure. This is one of the many toys coming out by Moose Toys this year for the new movie that's supposed to come out. This is a sequel to the original Space Jam. It does not continue on. It is a brand new movie. How cool is this? So this is fashion after LeBron James. He's actually in the movie as himself, but he is playing a basketball player who's in a bit of a rut. He has to save his son. And guess who comes to help him play the game of his life? The Toon Squad, Looney Tunes. We got all of our favorites from our childhoods. Guys, this is such a cute movie. I saw the trailer and I thought it was just adorable and fun and my kids loved it, so I love it too. Wanna to thank Moose Toys for sending me this brand new toy to show you. So I'm gonna break it down, show you how it works. Then you could check out on my Instagram and my TikTok featuring my boys where you could see them interacting with the doll itself. And something really cool, I'll show you another toy that's coming out the new Marvin the Martian Ultimate Toon Squad figure. This is really cool because it looks like he is an actual standalone figure and you can use him to operate this robotic version of himself. Oh my gosh, it's so awesome. Take a look at the back of the box. It shows you the Space Jam New Legacy logo and the artwork for the figure. And a little blurb back here. Let's read it. Welcome to the jam. Basketball champion and cultural icon LeBron James goes on an epic adventure with Bugs Bunny and the Looney Tunes in the animated live action event Space Jam, A New Legacy. Here is the figure out of the packaging. It's 12 inches tall, has some points of articulation, and it's wearing the Toon Squad uniform. So obviously LeBron James has already joined the Toon Squad. You can activate his phrases from the movie by just pressing the button on his chest. You want to play me in basketball? Now, there seems to be a lot of phrases. However, I thought there would be like maybe a try me mode. There is not. There's just the battery compartment in the back. It takes three button cell batteries. Those are the LR44 batteries and they come with it. There's a speaker in the back as well and you could see his joints over here and I'll get to that again in a second. I wanted to show you the spots where you'll be actually placing his accessories. So these two holes in the back over here. Then if you look at his hand, he has this like nodule sticking out that's for the basketball it comes with two basketballs one's a regular basketball and another one is a bombskeball i don't know if it's called that but i'm calling it that anyway <laughs> i would think that'd be something that like acme would come up with i'll show it to you you tell me <laughs> but you see this little notch over here this is actually can be placed in lebron's hand here is the regular basketball so get these packs and i'm going to actually connect the um, claw arms to the back of the claw pack. This is a one-time installation. You can remove the claw pack from his back if you don't want to play with it with all of the acne contraptions attached to him. Also comes with a mallet and the mallet has a basketball on one end and a basketball on the other and you're gonna place this in LeBron's left hand. In order to attach the claw arms, you have to snap it inside the claw pack. You're gonna see like, you can match it up over here. It has like these little notch. You're just gonna match it up and it just snap into place. There's also these little notches out here where you're gonna be able to put the bomb skiball. <laughs> it's actually called a basket boom. I wish it was called a bomb skiball. This is a basket boom. And you're gonna put the basketball you could connect the basket boom and the basketball to the claw arms, or you could put one or the other in his right hand. He has a little notch that you can just attach articulation. So let's see. So we have a nice clicky head that goes up and down all the way around too. Then let's check out the arms. So we have an articulated joint at the elbow and the shoulder roll around and around. His wrists are not articulated, but it's really, really nice, strong articulation in the arms. It's really great. And in the shoulders. Oh, and the elbows. Nothing at the knees, 
but we have it at the hip joints. Well, let's just kick my tripod. And let's take a look at his kicks over here. He's got big, gigantic red sneakers. And he's got his uniform, which is really cool. I like the way the uniform is designed, especially this like logo here. It reminds me of when they say, that's all folks, like when Porky Pig like breaks through that splash screen and says, that's all folks, biddy, 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 that's all folks. So I'll just keep saying that's all folks, but I like that. It's really, really cool detail. Very, very nice. Let's see what other um, things he says. I'm able to like sit him down so I can get him in the frame. Let's hear all of his phrases. Space Jam A New Legacy is bringing a whole new storyline into play here, perfect for parents and their kids who grew up, or the parents who grew up with Space Jam now can enjoy Space Jam A New Legacy with their kids. How cool is that? You wanna play me in basketball? Now, this is easy to put on and to take off. So in case you wanted to play with it without, the packs or any of the accessories, you can totally do that. Now with the actual claw pack on, this is articulated as well, so it goes up and down. So you can put the you can put the basket boom and the basketball in if you wanted to. It means business. It snaps right on. Basket boom. He stands up nicely too with the claw pack on. It doesn't really add too much weight to him. It's distributed nicely. Now we have the mallet. We could put this in LeBron's left hand. Now I wish I knew what he was gonna do with these actual accessories. However, we can totally create our own scene before we see the movie and try to get an idea of what is going to be happening in the film. So since we have articulated parts with this figure, you're able to put the mallet up and down, swivel it from side to side. Now, there is no mechanism over here to make these pop out on their own. However, you could make this go up and down. So if he's actually running the court, he could use this claw arm to actually try and get, like shoot the ball in the hoop. You could move his legs and you could do all of this while you have these accessories on. Now let's say you don't wanna play with these accessories, you just wanna play with the action figure himself. You don't need to play with those accessories, you could play with this figure on its own. You could also include the regular basketball and put this in LeBron's right hand. Now you can move him around. Now you could also play with other toys that are coming out for Space Jam A New Legacy and incorporate them all. They're coming out with smaller action figures, even a basketball playset, which is a lot of fun that pops up and has its own scoreboard. It's a lot of fun new toys coming out. Now, if you're playing with the other Warner Brothers characters, like the other Looney Tunes characters like Bugs Bunny, they can do something really fun like they normally would. Uh-oh. Overall, the figure looks really, really cool. He has a really serious face because he's really just, he definitely wants to get his son back and he's trying to win. So he has all of these cool accessories, like this claw pack with these claw arms, typical basketball, a basket boom, and this mallet, all to help him succeed playing with the Toon Squad. Overall, the Art on this figure, the paintwork, everything's really, really nicely done. I actually made that little uh, nick when I was unboxing it. It's packaged in a really, really nice box. You need a scissors to get it out. And I was a little sloppy with it when I was taking it out of the box. However, overall, I think this is a quality figure. Moose Toys produces nothing but great quality products. Love their toys. And I am so excited. They're actually doing some more action figures. Really blow up. Now, 
Guys, let me know what you think of this new toy in the comments below. Will you be getting this action figure? I think the Marvin the Martian one is totally something that I need to collect. I love Marvin the Martian. He is one of the funniest, coolest characters. Um, even though Wile E. Coyote is actually my favorite and Foghorn Leghorn, but that's a whole other story. Guys, let me know what you think of the new LeBron James Ultimate Toon Squad figure. Really, really cool. And check out my information in my description below where you can get your own Space Jam and new legacy toys. Thank you so much to Moose Toys for sending me this first look. It's really awesome. Make sure you don't forget to like this video and please subscribe to my channel if you'd like to view more unboxings like this. <laughs>